the number one pest that has run most farmers out of business is Duta absoluta or what we call leaf miner. It's the most destructive pest in tomato farming due to its infectiveness to most chemicals caused by insect nature of damage. Actually, it tends to hibernate between the layers of the leaves so that when you apply the chemicals, they are much not effective. To identify them very easily, you can see some marks as if a kind of snail passing by. We often call them broad-shaped mines on the leaves. Rarely you find them on stems, but you can also find them there. The best control for tuta absoluta is applying the best chemicals early. So you can apply belt for a male at the rate of 4 ml in 20 liters of water or ml on 10 ml per 20 liters of water. These applications should be done from the third week after transplanting and you continue at least weekly, weekly, weekly. And when you apply, you apply on the leaves, below the leaves, and also on the soil. Okay? Why do we apply on the soil? So that we can manage to kill all the eggs laid on the soil. Below the leaves, you need to control it, and also on top, control it. When you do this, you will manage to have a total control before it reaches the last stage where it's like a fly. Remember, it goes the whole metamorphosis. So if you don't control it that before becoming a, an insect, it will be hard. And this is what has caused most farmers low yields. You find fruits, they have made some holes and buyers don't also want to bite them. No one wants to buy a tomato with walls made of insects. So the best way to ensure that you, you can use bait for a male per 20 liters of water or emerald 10 ml per 20 liters of water and apply early. There is no shortcut about it.